Hi, this is John from PortableFreewareGames.com and I'm not here to show you a game. I'm actually here to show you a pretty cool piece of free software. Okay, so if you click on your browser and you type in PortableFreewareGames.com I want you to click on the software option and then scroll down to the bottom of that page Choose page 2 and it's the first option, the first, the first application uh, in this list here, Apache Open Office. I want you to click on that wee image and that will take the download page where you've got a big image from the application, you've got a description of the application and you've got two download links for the application. Uh, the first link is for the, the portable version uh, and it's stored on portableapps.com it's distributed from portableapps.com it's not it's not stored on my website another version is the installer version when you can go direct to apache.org and download the installer version I think I'm going to go with the, the portable version so if you click on that wee link there that'll take you to the download page for the latest version of the Apache Open Office you've got two options here you've got one with the standard language pack and you want for all language packs. Uh, the standard language pack, as explains here, uh, it's, it's all the most common languages English, Chinese, French, German, Italian, Japanese, Korean, Portuguese, Russian, and Spanish. Uh, and the all languages will be a lot of different other languages as well. So I'm just going to click on this one here for the, the standard language pack. Click on that. And here we go, save. And this is the file here that you'll download. OpenOffice Portable.paf. Uh, P it's a PAF file, file, that means it's a portable apps format file, and it's basically a, a self-extracting archive. So what we're going to do is to double click this. And it's asking if you want to run this file. Yes, I want to run it. I want it to be in English. Next, there's a, the, the Open Office uh, license agreement. I agree. And then it says install, but when it says install, what it really means is unpack. So it's asking me who to uh, unpack it to. And as you can see, it says on the desktop. And that's exactly where I want it to go. So install. And that's the application unpacked to my desktop. Here it's here. And now I should really explain to you what this application is all about and what it does. Uh, basically, it's an office suite, uh, very much like uh, Microsoft Office, but in some ways it's better, in some ways it's not quite as good. But we'll get to that in a minute. So uh, I've chosen to download the portable version on my desktop here, and now we're going to have a look at what this, what this includes. So you double click that folder and here you are, a list of applications Office Base, Office, Cal Office Calc, Office Draw, Office Impress, Office Math and Office Writer Portable and then you've got Open Office Portable there uh, if you click on that, that'll just, that'll just give you a menu with all the applications included in it and now I think I'll go through these applications one at a time just to show you what they do at the top here you've got Open Office Base Portable that's for creating new databases and uh, creating and maintaining databases which is quite a complicated job made easy by this software uh, and it's one of the applications that is included in this software that isn't included in Microsoft Office uh, we're not going to take it any further than this, I don't want to create a new database uh, but I'm just giving you a, a look at what the, the interface looks like and how easy it is to use you've got a choice here, create a new database or open an, an existing database well I don't have any databases handy right now and I'm not really going to create a new one for the for the sake of doing it. Uh, I'll just leave it at that for the first application. That's how easy it is to use. Uh, the second one, Open Office Calculator. As you might have guessed, the name Calculator. Uh, it's for doing mathematical equations on a spreadsheet. 
Uh, again, this is another application that doesn't come with Microsoft Office, uh, and it's a very handy wee thing. As you can see, it looks a lot like uh, Microsoft Word, actually, or Microsoft Excel. But again, a very easy to use software, it makes complicated work pretty easy. And the next one here we've got is OpenOffice Draw Portable. And that's just a, a drawing application to create in, uh, some designs. Uh, you can start off making some pretty basic uh, scribbles, really. And you can move all the way up to pretty in depth, pretty uh, advanced uh, graphics if you've got the time and you've got the skill. Uh, but the software makes it easy, uh, or easier than it would be without it. Open Office and Press Portable. This is for creating presentations, uh, a, lot, a lot like PowerPoint presentations. Uh, you know, you get one page and you link onto another page and onto another page. Uh, very handy wee thing, uh, and it's very easy to use. Again, I'm not going to actually go as far as making a, a presentation, but it's got an option here to choose from templates. There's one there. There's one of the templates. So again, I'm not going to bother too much with that. The next one is Open Office Math. As you can see, all these mathematical symbols here and equations. Uh, if that's your thing, if that's what you're into, uh, this is the this is the software for you. Straightforward enough. You've got a, a user interface. You've got options here. Um, very easy to use, very easy. And the last but not least is OpenOffice Writer. This is the equivalent of Microsoft Word. This is a, a writing program, a writing application from anything from letters to manuscripts to postcards to, to whatever. Whatever you want to write and print, and you can do that using this software. I should also say that all the, uh, the applications that are created by OpenOffice are completely compatible with uh, Microsoft, Microsoft Office. So you can make you can make uh, you can make files with one of these applications, and you can use it on another, which is a handy we think you have. And that's about it. That's about every application I explained to you. Uh, you should have a good idea of what this application is all about. Uh, there are a few free open office suites out there. Uh, LibreOffice is one that springs to mind, and a few others. But in my opinion, this is by far the best free office suite. And it's completely portable if you want the portable version. You can stick it on a flash drive and take it to work, take it to school, take it to college, take it wherever you like. Uh, you can create your files and then store them on the same flash drive. It's a handy wee thing. So I hope you download this application. I hope you have a lot of fun messing around with this application. And I hope you subscribe. Thanks for watching.